Hi, I'm Sango and today we're going to be modeling some trousers. So open up Blender, delete all the starting objects, go File, Import, .fbx, go down to the armature drop down, ignore leaf burns, and locate where you've saved that file. The base mesh file that is. So open that up. And then what I'll do is just drag drag a box across the legs and that's going to select the armature and the trousers and then you can go control i to invert selection and then delete so here we've got the legs we just want to edit them to make them look more like trousers so tab into edit mode you add in more loop cuts you want to do that kind of bring them out a bit so they look less skin tight and more baggy on the body same on the other side another loop cut So scale, shift and Z and that's going to make sure it's not scaling on the Z axis, it's just X and Y that it's moving on. And again here. Make sure you do it from the side view as well. Just because here you can really see the definition of the knees and that's going to make it look skin tight. And in this case, that's not what I want. And just adding in some some pleats and folds for the for the trousers. And same on the other side. I want to add a side pocket on here as well, kind of like cargo pants. side. That's Alt E and extra long normals. Add in a bit of a pocket, extrude that the same way again.
I'm gonna bring this part out a bit as well. So it's again, so it's not looking so skin tight. So I want more of a baggy feel to them. I can even get rid of this sharp edge as well. So if the if the edge is blue, that means it's a sharp edge, which means um, the the smooth shader will just ignore that line, and you'll be able to see the the hard edge on it. If you right click. Once you've got them selected, you can go clear sharp. I'll get rid of that for you. The idea is just to keep going like this until you're happy with it. Keep looking around, checking the shape. And then sooner or later you'll hit a point where you're happy with it. And again, if you click on this overlay drop down, you can go on statistics just to keep an eye on the amount of triangles you got here. 1,500 is the maximum allowed for the lower body. So make sure you don't exceed that. And then if you are around 500, that's good, the lower the better, as long as you can put forth your idea and, and the design within that, that amount, then you're good to go. You don't have to fully fill out the entire 1,500 limit. I think I'll add another pocket down here. Again, Alt E, extrude along normals. Just to get that out. And then add in another flat. And on the other side as well. Yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with that shape there. So that's how to model some some trousers from the base mesh. So next we'll go on to doing a little bit of sculpting, just to add in, uh, just to emphasize the folds, make them look a bit nicer. And then we'll, we'll apply the seamless texture we've made. And then I think we're ready to go. So I'll catch you in the next one.